Hey, what's going on, Gemini's? Butch Chair here. Gonna do your one week read. Uh, it is a general read, so it will not resonate with everyone. It is for your sun, moon, rising, and your Venus. For all you cross watchers, roles can be reversed. Uh, if you haven't already and you enjoy the channel, enjoy the vibe, like and subscribe. Um, join our little tarot community. Everyone is welcome. And uh, for all you that already have, you know I got nothing but love for you. I appreciate all the the comments, donations, and, and emails that you guys send me. Um, you know, your everlasting support means the world to me. And uh, with that being said, <laughs> always feel free to comment down below. So let's get it. The first will be how it says Gemini. What is going on for Gemini? All right, Gemini's. So the first thing I have, Gemini's, is I feel like there's someone that wants you, wants to come back. You know, I feel like there is someone that wants to reconcile with you. Now, I feel like this, this person has been struggling with coming forward. You know, I feel like they want to, you know, and, and I feel like they've been thinking about this a lot lately. I feel like they really want to make things work. Now... I do get the sense that this person hasn't, you know, they haven't always been on board. I feel like they may have been afraid to take that leap of faith in the past. You know, I feel a lot of hot and cold energy that came from them previously. But like, I, you know, I, I just feel like they, they weren't sure what you wanted. They weren't sure how seriously you took them. And I feel like the reason why you didn't come off as taking them seriously, because I feel like they didn't act serious. You know, like I said, with that hot and cold energy, not willing to take that leap of faith, you know, not willing to commit. I feel like in the past, they weren't ready to commit. You know, they didn't know where you stood, what you wanted. I feel like it was something that was casual, that, that was starting to head into something more. And that's when you got that hot and cold from them, because like, like I said, I feel like they weren't ready to commit. But emotionally, they haven't walked away from this. I feel like they do have a lot of feelings for you that they never really, you know, they never really exposed to you. And like I said, I feel like, I just feel like they, they, they were reading this all wrong. You know, they were ha having a hard time picking up what it is that you wanted. So that made them not, that made them, you know, not, it made them not willing to commit because they didn't want to commit to something that they didn't know would work out. Like this person, I feel like this person really, it's almost like they need to know before they make a move. They, they need to know all the possible outcomes before they take that next step. And I feel like they had a hard time reading you. But like I said, I feel like they've been going through a lot of a lot of struggling lately. I feel like they really want to come back to you. They really want to make this work. They really want to give to the situation. 
And I feel like they haven't, like I said, they haven't really walked away from this. Now, they may even come off as they got over this. They may come off and put up this confident front, but I, I, I don't feel like that's who they really are. You know, I feel like they want more from you. And I, and I feel like the part of them that didn't give before, the only reason they didn't give before is they, they didn't know what you wanted. They didn't know if you wanted more. Like I said, I feel like they have a really hard time reading you. You know, they want to build a foundation. They want a family. They want a partner. And they want that with you. Now, I feel like this will come off a little unexpected because, like I said, I feel like they went cold on you. They felt like they weren't, you know, they weren't willing to commit. But like I said, I feel like the reason why they weren't willing to commit is because they didn't know what you wanted. You know, I feel like they were picking up. They were picking up on, on things that weren't really there, looking too deeply into things that weren't really being said, but just. I, there was a lot of confusion. And like I said, I feel like they do regret not giving to the situation because they do want to come back. They do want to make this work. You know, like I said, they have a lot of love for you. You know, they want to give you everything that you deserve. But they weren't sure that you that you were willing to accept it from them. Like I said, I feel like it was something something that was very casual and light. And once they started catching real feelings, that's when they, they stopped giving to the situation. That's when they went hot and cold because, like I said, I feel like in that moment they felt like you may not want the same thing. And then coming forward, you know, it's almost like that situation where they'd rather hurt themselves than let you hurt them. And then coming forward when they didn't feel like that's what you wanted... You know, but this person wants to be with you. They want to build with you. Like I said, they want that foundation. They want to build something strong here. And, and they look at you as their person. Emotionally, they haven't been able to walk away from this. Now, moving forward with this person, I feel like this person is going to give you a lot more of them. And expect, you know, expect, expect this person to be more upfront and honest. Like I said, I feel like they... That internal struggle they're dealing with is the fact that they knew they didn't give enough. They knew they didn't give you what you deserved. And it's almost like they backed out before they even found out what was really there. Now coming forward, coming back, you know, like I said, they want to be with you. I feel like they found a lot of balance. You know, they find a lot of balance in the situation. You know, you have everything they want. I feel like you always did. And once they realize that, that's when they, they kind of went cold on you. You know, sometimes when people have deep feelings for someone and, and they, they finally figure it out, or they, they actually, you know, have these strong feelings, but they don't feel like their per person feels that way, it's almost like they imagine or assume what that person's thinking. And this person assumed what you were thinking. Instead of just coming right out and asking you. Instead of coming right out and being honest. But like I said, I don't feel like that's going to be a problem moving forward. I feel like this person is going to be very honest. And like I said, I feel like it may catch you off guard because this person, they've been wanting to come back. They've been wanting to make this work. And like I said, when they when they come forward, I feel like you won't be expecting it. Because I feel like you felt like they gave up on you. But this person hasn't given up on you. You know, I feel like they, they kind of gave up on the idea of moving forward because they didn't feel like you were on board. You know, in the crosswatch in this situation, um, you know, we can't assume what other people are thinking. The, you know, we need to be completely, completely transparent and open. When we want, we have questions and we feel like we're with the right person, you know, we, we need to try to make that work in any way we can. We can't just walk away because we feel like they may say no. You know, that's like going to a job interview, waiting 
you know, getting the interview, waiting in the in the waiting room, and then when they call you in for the interview, you're le you leave. You know, because they might say no, or they probably aren't going to give me the job. We can't do that. Give it a hundred percent, and if it doesn't work out, you can always say you gave it a hundred percent. Now, like I said, this person sees you as their person. They want to build a foundation. They are going to give you a lot more than they gave you in the past. But I feel like they're going to come off, you know, it, it, they're going to come, you know, that, that emotional side is going to come out of them. And I feel like you won't be expecting that either because I feel like there was a part of you that felt like they didn't care because they didn't give in the past. Now with this person, we have a lot of fire. Uh, Sagittarius, Leo, Aries. Um, we have some water. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. We have some Earth as well. Uh, Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus. But like I said, I feel like... I feel like this is going to catch you off guard because I feel like you, you didn't expect this person to be back. You know, I, I feel like you felt like they went cold on you because they weren't interested. But in all reality, it's the exact opposite. You know, some people take that situation a little differently. Um, but that's what I have for you. Be good. Take care. Stay safe.